Well, hello. A hush falls over the crowd as Cooper studies the board. He makes his move, and he solves the equation. The crowd goes wild. No bell, no bell. Howard, flashback sounds. I've always loved trains. There's a yellow rose of Texas that I'm gonna see. In fact, if my career in theoretical physics hadn't worked out, my backup plan was to become a professional ticket taker, or hobo. And when I figured out that trains allowed me to prove Newton's first law, I felt like Neil Armstrong on the moon, alone and happy. Shelly, dinner's ready. Hey, what are you doing out there? George, language. What language? I was exploring dimensional kinematics. Admit it, he's adopted. How can I be adopted when I have a twin sister? Think, monkey. Think. That's enough. Now let's pray. A moment, please. <sighs> Leave him be. He can hold hands with his family. It won't kill him. We don't know that. Did you wash your hands for dinner? None of your business. Hands to mittens. Thank you, God, for this food we are about to receive and bless the hands that prepared it. Amen. 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 Everybody excited to start school Monday? How can I be excited when he's going to be in the same grade as me? Don't worry, Georgie. I'm not planning on being in the ninth grade for very long. All I know is he's not in the same grade as me anymore, and I'm thrilled. Good luck with your finger painting. You're going to get your ass kicked in high school. Hey! Ow! <laughs> Don't you throw something at the dinner table, George! Jane Goodall had to go to Africa to study apes. I just had to go to dinner. You understand that some people are going to be intimidated by you because of how smart you are? Or maybe they'll recognize my intellect and make me their leader. Lord, look after my son. Don't let him get stuffed in a gym bag. Oh, dear. You doing OK? I guess. Hey, Mom, look, that girl's pregnant. Congratulations. All right, everybody. I'm sure you're all aware we have a student with us who is remarkably gifted. Yes, Sheldon? This boy's hair is too long. This boy is wearing sports attire outside of a designated area, and this girl's blouse is diaphanous, which means I can see her brassiere. <laughs> also, in violation of the grooming code, you have a bit of a mustache. <laughs> this boy does not belong in our school. Five minutes into my math class, he questioned my credentials. He said I was intimidated by his intelligence. Oral Roberts University is a wonderful school. Why would you entertain evil thoughts? I don't think this part applies to me. Shh. I'm only nine years old. Most evil doesn't start till puberty. How about we lose the bow tie? Why? Look around, honey. No one else is wearing one. Perhaps I'll start a fad. Why can't we watch DuckTales? Because we don't learn anything. It's TV. We aren't supposed to learn. When we get home, I'm going to kick your little balls. You can't. They haven't descended yet. Mom? What? When should I be expecting my testicles? What is wrong with him? Nothing is wrong with him. Now turn around before I knock your lights out. Hello. And for the record, they descended when I was 15. Go play. I played. Hey! You're not going to make it in this school if you keep ratting people out. But they were breaking the grooming codes and the dress codes. I saw one boy with a T-shirt that said, bite me. Yeah, that's terrible. Do you ever wonder why we moved from Galveston to Medford? I tend to wonder about the bigger questions. OK, well, here's why. Your dad had a real good coaching job, and I saw some grown-ups breaking rules. And you told on them? You know what happened? Justice descended upon the rule breakers? I got fired, Sheldon. Dad? Are you sad that you got fired? Mostly angry. But yeah. Maybe a little sad. All right, let's say grace. Thank you, God, for this food we are about to receive and for the nourishment of our bodies and bless the hands that prepared it. Amen. Amen. That was the first time I held my father's hand. I wouldn't touch my brother's hand until 17 years later. 
thanks to the invention of Purell. Well,